All right, gonna be live. So oh, hey, hello everyone. Welcome to CG Boss. All right, everyone. Welcome to CG Boss. Today it's uh, gonna be just me, just trying out this YouTube stuff. I'm gonna talk about YouTube for this channel. Yeah, it's been a while, man. Um, you know. I haven't done live streams like that before, but, uh, you know, I think it's, I want to give it a shot. I've been thinking about, you know, doing YouTube. That's the title of this thing today. It's kind of like a, just sharing my thoughts on it. Yeah. YouTube 2024. Yeah. I, I, uh, I don't know what I will be, I'll be uh, doing for YouTube. Yet, you know, I've tried to use this channel for making games and, uh, you know, making, uh, what do you call it, making, sharing my art, but I never really got far. I've been thinking of just going more into YouTube this year because, you know, I saw two videos, one by Copy Blogger. I hope I can find it. I'm not sure if I can share it here with you. But there's this guy from Think Media also. Uh, let me just share it here. This uh, window. Yeah, so if we can see my window here. Let's put the streaming software. Yeah, this guy, Sean Channel, he talked about why you need to go into YouTube. Uh, I think you can sign up on his YouTube channel. There's some interesting stats such as you know, it's better than, it's a lot of people are searching it and it's one of the better social platforms, which is like a library, right? He calls it a library, um, you know, but of course he's telling us to niche down. I've tried many things, but I'm not sure yet. So this is probably the start of, of uh, you know, of uh, what I want to try and do with this channel. Not sure yet. Yeah, so I've been thinking either I can focus it on AI art, perhaps, maybe, I'm not sure, or I can focus on web development. Yeah, you know, there's a few channels that do web development pretty well, right? Such as the, uh, what's that guy's name? Stefan Nishko. Yeah, there's a few, you know, it's either I can do game development, which I am, Web development, AI art, concept art, you know, I'm not so sure yet. Yeah. Uh, but yeah, I think the, the the point I want to make is that, you know, I want to use YouTube as a place to be discovered and document my journey, you know. Uh, I think it's an excellent it's a platform that if you, I think you got to put a lot of effort to it. Yeah, so... If you do, maybe you might get uh, somewhere, you know. Yeah, so there is all this. Um, yeah, so. Yeah, this one. Was it this? I can't remember. Yeah, that, but he has a lot of videos. The other one is Copy Blogger. That's the Think Media one. Yeah, this guy is a blogger, and I think this video that. I don't think you can hear the sound. This one, yeah. Rethinking online business, lead generations. Yeah, this is the one that I saw. There's a section here where it... Yeah, so I, let me just share the screen. Share tab. Yeah, I hope it works. Yeah. Firstly, going back and forth in my head, like, yeah, if I want to be a YouTuber, then I should spend more time on YouTube. But I like writing. I like newsletters. I like email. And so my priority was always let me focus on on the blog, get as much traffic as possible. And you're so when when did that start happening? The, I've been on YouTube happened? for four years now, taking it seriously. Yeah, that is blowing me away. But let's talk about the blog real quick. I mean, the cool. blog is very important to me because it's the home base, right? 
and I spent yeah. a lot of time optimizing my posts for SEO. And I, I don't know if your listener is going to... Yeah, so, I mean, the, the gist of it is basically they talk about why YouTube may be better for discoverability than than uh, using, uh, what's that thing, you know, blogging. I actually like blogging. I used to have my old website here. Yeah, but I've started to relook at it and say, hmm, maybe it's time to uh, to start using it as just like a landing page or a hub. Yeah, so this is my old website. This is the old website. Yeah. Yeah, I was saying I want to use it as a hub of some sort where, you know, people can link here and see stuff, content, which I have not updated in like one year. But um, so this is the website, yeah. Yeah, I was saying, yeah, I haven't updated this in a long time and yeah, the content is getting stale. It still gets some hits, not a lot, but... You know, I, I do like blogging, but I think going forward, I better put it into YouTube. It's, uh, I'm not sure if I can make money of it, but I think the point is to document as much as I can to, you know, basically say that, you know, I've, uh, did this stuff and experimented. I'm still, I think I'm still, I'm not so sure whether I should go into AI art or AI topics or. Uh, you know, I I actually have an idea to share my game ideas, which is uh, from, uh, where is this? I need to share the screen here. In Dali. Uh, so there, there's some ideas I have about using AI art, maybe creating stories, creating, uh, what do you call it? You know, sharing the world building I'm thinking about. And, uh, you know, maybe, I don't know how it'll take off, but yeah, I'm still, still researching the this topics, whether is it worth doing or just documenting everything I'm doing, yeah. The other one is web development, which I'm quite heavily involved in, but uh, I, I don't know. I don't know whether it's uh, uh, something I want to talk about because there's a lot of other good web development channels out there. And uh, yeah, so yeah, probably going. I probably may sign for this Think Media course, and you know, try to take it more seriously. YouTube, yeah, because I do see that people have uh, some channels. They have like they just you know promote their product or some or whatever project, and they get a lot of uh, interest in it. So YouTube is can be a powerful thing. I find it more useful than say. Facebook and TikTok. TikTok, I, I did pay for some like cheap ads, like five bucks or ten bucks, but you don't get the subscribers in, you know, if you know what I mean. Like they make money from from you continually paying for the, uh, uh, you know, the service. Well, it's YouTube, it's free. You can pay for ads, but I think the, the engine is slightly different. Uh, they say it's more like a library where people search for stuff and uh, yeah, you can find, what do you call it? Find things, you know, find answers. It's basically like a, a second search engine for Google. Yeah. Oh, what's going on? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Oh, well, anyway, hope you, well, this is just a short live stream. I'm just trying to just share my thoughts here and uh, probably start making content in the next few weeks and months and learn all the things about YouTube. So anyway, thanks for listening if you're, if you're here, but uh, yeah, see you around.